What's good, y'all? Welcome back to a brand new comic reaction to the latest issue, issue number three of Taz. We are back. You guys know what happened in issue one. You guys know what didn't happen in issue two. I was very pissed off with MGB on the cover and that thing when she wasn't in there. Hopefully, maybe in issue three, um, she's in this one. <laughs> actually, I just found out John Romita Jr. is actually on Twitter. He actually has a Twitter account. Uh, apparently, he like just started it recently, probably due to you know the new Tasm run. And he was like, and I saw a tweet where he's like, he's like working on like issue eight right now. And it was kind of interesting also seeing his setup and like kind of like how he draws and what like what his setup looks like and everything and how when he draws the uh, issues. And I quote tweeted me, and I quote tweeted it saying, "Is MJ in it?" <laughs> so yeah. Uh, I just want to know what the hell, what the bigger picture is for MJ. After that, then we can rule it. Then I can make my assumptions on what I think is going to be happening with her. But yeah, man. So hopefully, yeah, hopefully maybe in this one she makes an appearance. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know, man. I want to like this run, man, because, you know, John Romita's in it, and I've been enjoying the issues, but with M. Oh, hello there. I think that's I think that's a fucker. Uh, what was his name? Josh or something? Whatever his name. Jake. Well, I, I think this might be him. I can't remember. I but I think that's him. Anyway, let's jump right in. Alphabet City. <laughs> what the fuck is Alphabet City? It's fine. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, and oh, and this motherfucker is gonna talk to. Oh. The balls on this man, ladies and gentlemen. The balls on this man. And yes, I'm rocking Miles Morales. PJ Pants, if you're wondering. Rocking my boy Miles. Oh, the balls on this motherfucker. You have the nerve, the gall, the balls to steal my man's woman. And then you want to talk to him. You want to talk to him. The balls of you, good sir. The balls of you. Sam Wills, are you trying to piss me off? Well, he's not going to fight him anyway because, of course, Tombstone took him. But hey, I got my wish. MJ's in the issue. But why is it called Alphabet City? That, is that another city? Is, or is that just a joke for New York? <laughs> or some other reference that I am unaware of? Anyway. It's fine, MJ. I'm just going to talk to him. Yeah, sure you are, pal. And your Imperials are going to snap your neck. <laughs> Do I seem like a violent guy? You seem like a bitch. That's what you seem like, a pussy. Okay, he deserves that. Deserves what? The fuck MJ saying, bruh? I promise we're just gonna talk. Oh yeah, that's what Doc Ock wanna do. Just talk. And look what happened to him. I'm here. Talk to you later. Love you too. Fuck you. Who are you looking for? Peter Parker. How about that? Me too. This fucking guy. This issue's full of fuckers. Ah, damn, Zeb, are you trying to piss me off, good sir? He owes you money? No, he's making some phone calls. I don't appreciate- Oh! You don't appreciate! Well, fuck you! Because that's Peter's woman. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you. Ugh. Like I said, I want to like his run, but then you got this shit in here. I know, I, all, all I know for certain, unless this goes through some major turnaround, and obviously, as you guys know, Joe Quesada uh, was recently revealed or announced, like, last week. Joe Quesada has left Marvel. So, maybe if we're lucky, <laughs> maybe then, then we'll finally get Peter and MJ back together. But I'm not holding my breath, because I'm sure there's others in Marvel that are keeping up the good fight of keeping them keeping them far away, as far away from each other as possible. Man. Because Marvel Editorial hates us for some reason. Anyway. No, he's making he's been making some calls I don't And what do you mean some phone calls? He's only called MJ like once in the first issue. And she told him to stop calling. So unless he's been calling her off screen, which good on him, but the fuck you want about, bruh? Ha! Huh, knew that guy was a sicko. Had a feel Fuck you! I'm trying to collect the hospital bills. Guys lay guys laid up for months racking up the racks of a bill, then disappears. Really? You okay? Who cares? Wow, I didn't know. That's to de that's depressing. How much? Buddy, you don't wanna know. Okay, next page. What the fuck how much is it? How much does he owe him? How much for you how much for you to leave him alone for a couple of weeks? Oh. 
Alright, this um, Steve, Jeff, whatever the fuck his name is, I'm starting to like him. He's at least trying to help out Peter, at least for a couple of weeks. You, for real? You take Vimo? 1500 So what, you're like a nice guy or something? Just don't want, just don't like seeing, just don't like seeing someone get kicked while they're down. Hope he's okay. Hey, don't worry about him, about him, pal. He probably, he probably curled up in his bed all cozy, sleeping one off. Alright. I feel like Zeb Wells just like tried, like, listen, I know no one's gonna like him, but at least let me try. To at least make him less hated. He slept enough. Next page. There is one thing that is consistently great about this about Zeb Wells run, at least for now, when, unless he gets kicked off the book again, like he did with uh Jay with Jay Michael Straczynski's run. It's John Romita's artwork, man. Once again, this man don't miss. That'll be like the saving grace of this run. Jay John <laughs> this is gonna be John Romita Jr.'s artwork, man. That's gonna be like the saving grace of this. Wake him up. <sighs> you hear me? <sighs> Get up! Don't my mask. I don't play dress up. And I don't care who you are. Hear me? So is he, so is he actually going to take the mask off? Or is he going to leave it on? The next part. This is just, this is just so, so by the, by the end of this, I can, I can say we're even. Look! Look! That's all that's there. That's there. That's all. That's all that's there. That's all that's there is going to be. Yeah! Oh, 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 God, the chains are, like, shrinking. They're lowering. Oh, no, oh, my man, come on, bro. Why you gotta go, my boy? Peter, what did he do to you, man? He didn't, he didn't fuck with your daughter, man. Come on, why you gotta do Peter like this, man? He ain't done nothing to you. Chains are gonna give, and no one's gonna hear you. We're in an abandoned subway tunnel under the hall, under my Harlem safe house. What is this? This is this is me teaching you a lesson, or as Chase you would say, a teachable moment. <laughs> Y'all know me. First, a question: How'd you come and come to Harlem and bust up my gear with the rose? What did you have to do with it? What did it ha what did that have to do with you? <laughs> you guys are always trying to make it more complicated than it is. I'm a good guy. I try to stop the bad guys. Ha! Huh. Bad guys. Where you want? Where'd you want? Where'd you want these roses, boss? Upstairs with the crew, Donnie. Why the fuck would I want them down here? Roses? We're not talking about that yet. I want to talk about lions. Yeah, right. Lions. Makes perfect sense. Next page. Upstate New York. Who the hell are they? It's not picking up. Oh, it's Randy. Oh, did Rand Rand did Randy get a hair a hair a hair a haircut? His hair looks different. I swear to God, he used to not have that kind of look when we last saw him at Nick Spencer. I think I, I, I think I'm pretty sure. Was he was he like rocking dredge or something, or was that like the '90s? I can't remember. But I know he wasn't rocking that when we last saw him. Randy, put the phone down. We're on vacation. I know, but he usually called me back. You don't want him to think that. You want him to think that no good that his, that no girl girlfriend of of yours kidnapped his baby boy, huh? No, I wanted to talk to him before I. Well, you see, these 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 are the kind of trips I want to take you take with you, for you know a long time in the future. The future? Yeah, I'd like to plan plan on that, being together in the future. Randy Robertson, do you want me to marry? Do you want to marry me? <laughs> I'm glad at least somebody's happy. Oh, you know, if I do... Oh, right, he asked for... Yeah, right, he talked to Tombstone and, like, asked for her... And asked for her, asked for his blessing. If that was in the future, I would ask you to... Uh, in, uh, this place is great and all, but... No, dumbass, I'm asking you to marry me. Oh, I was gonna... But... Yes. Good answer. Now I've really gotta get ahead of... Get a hold of my, of my dad. It's ringing. So weird he is, he's not answering. <laughs> Next page. Lines stay out of people's way, for the most part, have for thousands of years. But even once in a while, you get you get a man, you get a man eater. Something sets them off, 
and they start killing people. Some of them keep going once they're full. Got bodies and count, got body, got body counts in the hundreds. People smarter than me rack their brains trying to figure out why they do it. Is it for food? Food dry up? Econ ecosystem change? Some kind of sickness? Poison? Read one of them try to blame an impact more impacted moral. <coughs> Loving this really. But my arms are falling asleep, so can we? Point is, out of all the explanations I read from all these from all these scientists, none of them was dumb enough to say bad lie. Next page. Now what? It's just the F train. Three trains. F doesn't come to Harlem. You're right. You're right, balls. My mistake. You're gonna blame that one on a sore tooth? <laughs> I love Peter's sense of humor, man. <laughs> what I was saying is, a dog bites a man, and you ask who, who's been kicking the dog. A man bleeds another. A man blends another man, and you ask how, how big a cage you should throw him in, because he's bad. I know it keeps you all nice and cozy, feeling real proud of yourself, but it makes you wonder what kind of good guy gives less thought to a man than an animal. You don't, you don't, you, you don't want to be called a bad guy. Got it. Can I go? You're missing the point. You've already decided what I am. And I haven't set, and I haven't spent a second asking why I am. Okay, Alonzo, Al, 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 Alonzo, Alonzo? Why, who is Alonzo? Or is that actually Tim Till's real name? I forgot. Why are you? That's a great question. Next page. Across town. Excuse me. Do you have service up there? I haven't had anything since I got in the car. No, nah, Mr. Robertson, no service in this area. This area? We've been driving here. We've been driving for 30 minutes. What do you mean? One sec, Mr. Robinson. Gotta pick up another passenger. Oh, shit. Hey there, Dub Roses. White Rabbit. Scooch over a bit, would ya? The boss wants to see you. And we're already late. Oh, shit. Next page. Uh, now we're getting Tombstone's backstory. People think fl fl filling my teeth with string was, was a strange choice. Wasn't choice at all. I grew up hungry, never, never enough to eat. Learned early on, no, no matter where, where the world had to offer, there was enough, there was enough left over, for, left over for me. Doesn't matter how much I ask, Psst, check it out. So I stopped asking, stopped talking at all. You want, you want, you want, you want to move, Lonnie? I'm asking, ask him, ask him to move. He never says anything. We'll say we'll see about that. Damn, they beat up Tombstone. Say, Uncle Larney, say, Uncle. Never made school with my lunch tickets. Stopped asking for help, and nobody offered. Not at school. Not at home. But I, when I stopped talking, I could hear what what the words was what the world was trying to teach me. I was learning its language. The older I got, the oldest one we got, and what the hell is it? What the hell is that in his hand? Is it like a nightstick or something? What the fuck is that? And if I was gonna make my way, I was gonna have to speak it. You know, you know what you have to say. You know what you have to say, Lonnie. Say it. If, if they wanted me to talk, I would talk. <laughs> What's he saying? He's whispering. Come on, Lonnie, spit it out. I'll give him some, I'll give him some help. There you Jesus Christ Did it break his arm or something? Like twist his right damn like did it like break his wrist or anything? Next page. I'd I'd make them I'd, I'd make them get close enough to hear me. Huh? What is what was that? In a language I chose to, in a language I chose to me. Too close. Oh, ho, 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 ho. damn, Tombstone Savage! 
next page, ladies and gentlemen. Those fuckers never ate off me again. And I kept the whisper. Because I decided that if you have business with me, you're going to be close enough to feel my teeth. At high school, I was eating well. Eating off everyone. <coughs> Ugh. Ugh. And my appetite grew. But it was always about the same thing. See, seeing that I had enough. Ooh, yo, did he like just break Robbie's, uh, Rob, Robbie's back? Doing whatever it took to keep it. Fishing the good, the good guys who would never understand. That's that there are no sins a man can commit in the process of feeding himself. We're ready, boss. What's all this? The rose, the roses, men. Huh. They're just what all your friends are gonna think. See, a good guy got got into this mess, and the good guys are gonna get out of it. My my men dress up like the roses goons are gonna go up on on a little rampage, shoot up 125th Street. As far as anyone will know, the rose will have a the rose will have ordered a massacre. One of your friends will see the carnage. And take care of Rich of, of Richie Fisk for me, Captain America. Daredevil don't care. I about to say I thought Captain like have a killing rule, but I guess you know he was in the war and you know shields. I guess he doesn't really have any qualms of killing necessarily. He isn't like Daredevil. He's like, no, I will not kill. <laughs> Tombstone, this is crazy. You don't want to do this. Civilians, they have nothing to do with this. Neither did you, but here you are. You can't. Ah! We're moving, lock and load. Before you die, I want you to know I've got, I've got your old friend Robbie Robinson. Gonna show him what happens when their kid, when this kid tries to take my daughter. Bro, yo, 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 your daughter asked him to marry him, not the other way, bro. <laughs> Just saying, bro. Come on, I thought y'all were cool now. Come on. Bro, he even asked you for his, for, for his, for, he even, like, he gave you the respect of asking you for your, for your blessing, bro. I say that's the most respect you can give a father, man. Like, bro, why are you, t come on, man. I'll say, I'll say hi, I'll say hi for you before I break him in two. Kill him. Don't do this! Next page. Lonnie, uh, Lonnie, stop! I've learned my lesson, I've learned my lesson! Man, you have, chump. Man, you have, champ. But it's too late to save the day. Come back! Do you hear me? Stop! I, 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 I. That was fine. All right, that issue was awesome. Those last couple of pages, bro. That was awesome. All right. Like I said, guys, there's like I want to love Zebwell's run, but obviously, then there's MJ. You know. But either way, man. This was a phenomenal issue, man. I loved it. Really enjoyed this one. Loved it with Tombstone's backstory. And of course, those last couple pages with Peter, man. That's fantastic. You never, you rarely ever see Peter get like that. So, you know you're in deep shit when Peter starts got to like that. Obviously, that's left man, you know. But, uh, yeah. Fucking Steve, Jeff, whatever the fuck his name was, isn't a complete asshole. But for some reason, he takes beef with Peter calling her once. But whatever. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll figure out the context of everything that's going on. And maybe then it'll make sense. We will have to wait and see, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, overall, I'm going to give this issue a 9 out of 10 dice. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Fill in the links in the description box below. And as always, come back for more. See you guys next time.